Welcome back, travelers. It is Slot of Havoc here, and we are back playing a little Project Ozone 2 Kappa Mode. Yeah! And I have gotten a little bit stuff done in the meantime, and I got plans to be productive today. So, as you can see, I can't see my mob farm. Because I'm getting ready to relocate that silly, silly mob farm to a new location. Yes. We are going to go ahead and uh, get ourselves set up to go to the next, was it the last millennium? So we can start soon doing some stuff out there. And that way, you know, I just, the storage chest, I believe, might be causing some of my issues. I know that actually my FPS is way low right now, and it's because the server itself is uh, a little bit sluggish. So it's causing my computer to go a little bit sluggish. Uh, not, a, not a big issue. Not, not a big issue whatsoever. I'm going to fix all of that very, very soon. But things like all these tile entities that I have from um, all the storage drawers is, you know, going into effect with it. And, you know, <clears throat> the frame rate's not horrible, at least not right at the moment. But my goal is to get it back up into the 60s where it should be. And I think it might just be a complete, you know, overhaul of stuff. I got to do, you know, enough talking about that. Everything else is running fine. So... Anyways, yes, we are going to go and set that up today, and we are going to make the most efficient, that I can think of, the most efficient uh, mob farm that we can, as well as I want to set up an efficient way to process all those legendary loot bags today. So yes, that's what we're going to do. However, I want to show you something because we're almost done. I've been working on the last couple items for Alpha. So... We are almost ready to make a diesel generator. Well, you know, get all the parts for the diesel generator. Now, I did make the mistake, again, of shift-clicking out. So I have my 14, <sighs> but I only got credit for two of them. So I have to make 12 more of those. Not a huge deal, just a little bit upset. But anyways, we're going to make up the rest of these really quick. So we've got the generator block. That's funny that... Well, that's interesting. Okay, so we got the generator block here. Um, so we're gonna need three of these, which means I'm gonna have to make this recipe twice. So I'm gonna need to make two of these guys. One, two. And yeah, I've been making some other resources uh, for some of the other equipment that I was making. So yeah. And now this should automatically switch over to radiator. Oh, that's kind of cool that that worked out that way. I'm going to need a water bucket. And then that actually will be really, really simple to make that one. Um, do I have a buck? I don't have an empty bucket. Oh, that's right. I just spent my empty bucket <clears throat> on that guy. So I didn't know that, um, was it extra utils? Yeah, extra utils had like trash cans for fluids. And I was trying to figure out why my Coke oven wasn't working because the creosote wasn't quite full, but it had too much to build another block and this one was totally full. So I threw a trash can fluids up here and it just dumped right into it and started going again. So cool, cool, cool. Lesson learned there. But anyways, um, yeah, I need to dump this block. Do I have a, yeah, I can just place one of these on top of it. Um, is there a place? I don't have torches right next to it so I can do it quickly. Yeah, there we go. I hate like having to pick up my torches afterwards. It's just kind of annoying. So usually if I do it pretty quick, I usually, Ah, uh, there was a torch somewhere over here. Um, there it is. Well, I mean, I have some on me at least. <clears throat> I usually can get it up quick enough, but not that time, but it's okay. So, anyways, getting that off the screen. We are almost, 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 almost done with Alpha. And I'm pretty excited about that. Uh, oh, I need to fill this up with water. Whew. Oh, yeah. And so, I don't know if you noticed the amazingly high jump. But I spent a little bit of time opening a whole bunch of legendary loot bags and trying to find some better armor. And I think, I mean, for the most part, I found a pretty good set. And I'll, I'll kind of show it to you in a second once I get these guys. Um, I need six of these. Really? I know I've got the steel. I know I got that. Come on. That's steel. That's copper. I know I have both of those. I know I have both of those. 
Yep, there's the steel right there. Um, there's a ton of copper. What? What is going on? One, two, three. I think it's just three of these I'm going to need. I'm not 100% sure. We'll see in just a second. And steel. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, what's going on? Uh, was the order different though? Did I get them out of order? There they are. One. Huh, there you go. Two. I'm using the cheaty bucket method. I don't care anymore. I said I wasn't going to, but I lied. I'm gonna do it because it's just easier. All right, so we got three of those, five of those. Detect those. Oh, please tell me those detected because Oh, I need one more radiator block. Okay. Did I shift click the last radiator block out? That's so annoying. Okay. One more. Hey, get in. This is. There we go. Take you out. There we go. Now detect. There we go. Okay, cool. And I just got to make. Um, well, 12 more of these. I've already got the 14, but I can make 12 more. So we'll make the 12 more and then, oh yeah, I want to show you my armor. It's, I mean, it's nothing special. Absolutely nothing special, but you know, it's cool. Um, what am I missing? Am I missing these guys? I'm probably missing a couple of these. Um, steel, steel, piston. I'm pretty sure I, oh no, you know what? I might need pistons too. Let us see. Do I have pistons? I have nine pistons. I need to make... 12 which is gonna be six which well i'm gonna need three more pistons so there we go doing the math in my head here all right so one two three three there's that do i have the steel pipes <coughs> i do not have the steel pipes okay so that's another one that i'm gonna need <coughs> so um heavy engineering you right there I'm going to need 12 of you total. I can only make nine. Why am I limited to nine? Am I that low on steel again? Please tell me I'm not that low on steel. I am, but I have some cooking up over here. And I also took a trip to the nether because I was trying to get some steel. Oh, that's gonna probably probably be plenty. We'll see. Um, I took a trip to the nether looking for uh, steel ore, right? So. Let me, let me take you through that little path, okay? I was like, hmm, how do I make a steel ingot other than in um, immersive engineering? And basically it all comes back to the steel ore. So I was like, all right, cool. Let's go to the nether and, and this is what I did, okay? Now you might see it, but I didn't see it at first. That says nether pig iron, right? So I see the nether rack, I see steel ore, it's over and over again. So what do I go do? I spend an hour in the nether running around trying to find steel ore right i passed by a whole bunch of pig iron and then i finally realized what i had done and so now i can just smelt those up and get a whole bunch of pig iron or the steel ore and then i can double the ores over in my furnace i believe i do believe my furnace will double the ores so then that'll give me 28 steel right there that's not too bad. Um, you're what? You don't cook steel? You got to be kidding me! Do you cook steel, or does it have to be done in the smeltery? Nope, that one cooks steel. But do you double? Oh man! <laughs> then I'm gonna get the dust. Well, will that one smelt up dust? Because I mean, it is doubling. So will this one smelt up dust? Okay, it will smelt up the dust. All right, cool. Okay, not a problem. So, I mean, that's 28 more steel. Anyways, back to this guy. So, we are making the heavy uh, engineering blocks, like so. Now, I have enough to make eight more. Um, what was I short on? Oh, I was short on the pipes. That's right. Let's make up some of the pipes. Um, one, two, three, four. Okay, cool. Now, I should be good. One, two, what am I short on now? Oh, I'm probably short on steel, uh, of course. Because why wouldn't I be? All right, uh, was that what my, uh, what my, oh, did I, I, please tell me I didn't shift click again. Please tell me I gr grabbed him. 
Oh, please tell me I grabbed him. Okay, we're going to bring you down here. Can I detect this real quick and see? Did I grab him? Okay, I did. Hoo, 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 hoo. I don't want to keep making these. Steel ain't cheap. I mean, it's not bad, but it ain't cheap, so. And uh, grab you. And that should be just about enough. All right, that was two. And there's two more. Okay. Wait, did I need... Oh, I needed two more. There we go. There we are. Diesel generator complete. All right, so I'm not sure if I'm going to put that thing together quite yet. But... At least the achievement's complete. So let's go ahead and claim some of these loot bags up. See if we get anything. Or loot chest. I always say loot bags. Um, yeah, the loot chest up. See if we get anything interesting. We are so close to completing alpha. I am so excited just for that reason. Like, you know, completing an entire section. That's that's a pretty pretty good accomplishment. Oh, yeah. In case you're wondering, I got the uh, tectonic petrothium from a cow. A Muflu cow. Just dropped them out. Let his uh, cool down run out, grabbed a bucket, and then put him back. So, yeah. So, that's how I got that. So, basically, we're down. I got four things left. We've got the requisite cat. Whatever. In pace. We've got the knapsack, the furnace upgrade, hell furnace, and then the extreme furnace. We're going to do these furnace upgrades. Portal gun. Portals in here? I did not even know that. Another zombie generator. A sponge. A uh, fleeting stone, another fleeting stone, salt ore. Okay, well, a freaking portal gun. No, 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 no kidding. The portal? I did not know the portal mod was in here. Um, okay, so if I put you there, yeah, 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 and you there, pew. oh, goodness, I'm going to have so much fun with that. I'm going to have so much fun with that. Oh, isn't there a way to turn them off? Okay, I'll just put them up here right now so I don't accidentally make any mistakes. Oh, that's awesome. The portal. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. You know, I wonder, I don't think the portal gun works across dimensions, but at least I could do like, you know, that's going to be on a flat surface, but whatever. Um, I mean, I could do like, pew, yeah, yeah, I'm going to bounce, but unless I hold shift. Oh, can I shift through? No, it's not going to happen. Um, let's see if I can get it right there. And get this one right here. <laughs> that could be really, really useful. Like, really useful. Oh, we're going to have so much fun with that. All right, let's go ahead and put you away for just a minute. Because that is not the point of what we're doing today. No, not at all. We are going to go ahead and get going on this stuff. So we can power our furnace, right? So we don't have to use this lava anymore. And that's using the uh, better furnace. Uh, I'm going to guess it's... Hmm. BFESU. Better furnaces electrical system upgrade. I don't know. Let's see what it actually stands for. Um, BFESU. There it is. The Better Furnaces Energy Storage Unit. Okay, I was like not even close, but cool. And where we have battery. Can I make a battery? <clears throat> uh, iron I have, copper I have. Ooh, I should have quite a bit of sulfur. Okay, let me get into the crafting menu here. All right, cool. So we need to make four of these. So I'm going to need four times six, 24 of these. I can make eight. Um, do I have any other kind of sulfur? I've got a whole bunch of sulfur ore. You know what? I have a whole bunch of sulfur over there. Hey, look at that. My portal gun just came in handy. Um, <laughs> I know I had sulfur in here somewhere. Okay, there's some sulfur. I thought I had sulfur going into these. So... Because I was getting so much of it from the... Oh, you know what? That's probably enough. I just realized how much I just grabbed. Oh, that's so cool. Just back and forth. Awesome. I can totally detect. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited right now. This is so cool. Uh, sulfur block. 
Yes, that's going to be enough. So what I needed, I needed four. Uh, four times six was 24. I have eight. So I need another 16. There we go. All right, cool. We got that. Now, B-F-E-S-U. There you are. All right, so let's make up four of you. One, two, three, four. Oh, they are non-stacking. Well, that's fine. Okay. And then I can make you. No, what am I missing? What am I missing? You, 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 and you. I know I have, a, oh, you know what? I actually could be out of iron in here. No, I got 10. One, two, three, four. And the other one's copper, right? Yeah, and I got you. Okay. Man, that is kind of annoying when it doesn't shift. Click in. Okay, cool. So now... I'm getting used to that BFESU. We will... Make you... Yeah. All right, cool. So we've got that guy. What else goes with it? We need the better furnaces electric heat source. Okay. All right, so better, yep, there it is. It's the whole name, it's a long name. Okay, so we're gonna have three more of those. Not a problem, we can do that. Uh, yeah, we got everything else, so let's make, let me get back in my crafting grid here and let us make up three more of these. Oh, I need to make these. Yes, one step, so three more, so I'm gonna need 18 of these. Um, hopefully I'm not going to need a lot more of these. Although I'm sure I can find the sulfur somewhere. <clears throat> okay. So got you, got you. Autofill. Yeah. One, two, three. Okay. Got you. And where'd you go? There you are. And now you should do it. Oh, come on. There we go. And got you. All right, cool. What else do we need? Upgrade package and storage upgrade. Okay. What is an upgrade package? I, I have to have all the materials for it. Like, there's no doubt in my mind. Uh, upgrade package. Is that it? Up, no, storage upgrade. Well, I need that one too, so. Oh, that's easy peasy right there. Um, I just need to make a chest probably. And, okay. So, we'll make you like so. There we are. And then dump that. And now we can make you. What oh, don't I have to have glass? I have to have stone. Um do I have stone? I, I have three stone. Jeez. Oh man, sometimes I really just can't win. Alright, um, let's see, we'll put you over here. There we go. Cook up. There we go. Oh man, the other one's probably faster. All right, there we go. All right, now we've got that, and I'm pretty sure I got the glass, but I'll double check just to make sure. Uh, quite clear glass. I don't know if quite clear glass will work, so let's see. It won't. Okay, so let me grab our chisel, which I believe is in here. I need to put it in my bag, but uh, yeah, there it is. Come on, my mouse is being a little funny. All right, here we go. So chisel up the glass. We'll just turn you into regular glass. We will, I always do that. Let me get this chisel out of my hand. The chisel, I have to say, is a bit annoying to me. Just the mechanics of you can't right click if it's in your hand because it automatically takes precedence over what you're doing. Okay, cool. And then there was another one, the upgrade chest or something like that. Uh, this one, upgrade package. All right, so two crafting tables and a chest with gold. Oh, that's that's freaking simple. All right, so chest and then crafting tables. Really, 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 we're going to do this to me right now because it's colored. You want the colored specifically? Okay. Planks. Like so. There we go. Come on. There we are. One, two. Get you in there. And now I can make that upgrade package. Up, Not gade. There we go. Upgrade package. There it is. 
Okay, cool. And that should be it. That should be it. That's everything. Okay, there it is. I was like, that's everything. All right, cool. So now we should be able to upgrade this to energy. And let me grab some energy conduit because I happen to have the energy conduit right, like kind of coming out close to under this thing. Um, yeah, I can just run it right through this line right here, right? Um, yeah, I'm gonna wreck my floor real quick, but it's okay. Didn't want to do that. All right, there we go. So let us shoot. Uh, um, let's put you back in where you belong. Now I'm going to have to reset you. There we go. And you're going to be on and out on green. And there we go. All right. Okay, cool. We're good. We're good, good, good. All right, and then energy conduit, like so. Right over here. And I think, while, while I'm thinking energy at the moment or whatever, I think I may end up doing, um, okay, so you're all connected, cool. The, uh, the refinery for immersive engineering, because I can set up a pretty easy farm, so that might actually happen. Okay, so there's that. Um, I think storage upgrade, you just click on this thing, right? Right click. There we go. Yeah, so now you can do twice as much in it. Awesome. And then, oh, this is actually not going to go there. Because this is where this unit goes, and then it gets power. There we go. So it's filling up. Cool. This has power. Awesome. Awesome. And then upgrade package. I really don't know what that does. Oh, is this the one? Hold on. Yes, you can put the upgrades in here, right? So, I don't, well, I don't need the liquid one anymore. But I can, like, put the advanced ore processing in here, right? And then just boop. And that has advanced ore processing now. Oh, that's so cool. And then, let me put the steel away. That's all done. I can put you away and put you away. And I don't really need you. Um, there's another one. <clears throat> the efficiency upgrade. The advanced efficiency upgrade. Um, can I make you? What am I missing? Uh, I'm missing the original. What happened to my efficiency upgrade? I had one. Um, I have the lap. Okay, I have. To, I just need some ender pearls. Oh, look at this. My portal's coming in useful again. There we go. One, two, three, four. And yes, I, I will have to get that farm going again soon because I am low on ender pearls. But for right now, I'm okay with it. I'm, I'm okay with what's going on. Okay, so one, two, three. And I just grabbed an extra for fun. All right, so there's you. And then I don't remember if I have any gas tears. That actually might be what I'm missing. I don't have any gas tears. Okay, but I can make the eyes of Ender real simple. Um, heh. You know what? I'm not gonna spend too much more time on this. Um, actually, I'm not gonna spend any more time at all because this is simple, simple stuff. Nothing terribly exciting. The furnace is, you know, coming along. And, you know, I don't see us going to Erebus today. So I'm not even gonna get the red Forget it, that's what we're doing. We're gonna go to Erebus, Erebus. Because it's not hard to get to Adirbis, and that would be another achievement we would be accomplishing. I need to get those facades, the the conduit facades or whatever, because I don't like the look of that, and I don't like all those, you know, visible gaps down there. But heh, what you gonna do, right? So my plan was to do that, huh? But Arebus sounds so much more fun right now. I don't know about you, but I think Arebus sounds more fun. Let's get going to Arebus. I haven't made that portal yet. Actually, I haven't made uh, Erebus. I think it's Mossy Stone or something like that. Oh, yeah. You know what? There's there's a mission for it. Um, well, let's claim this. We finally got this one out of the way. All right. What did we get? We got Lily Pads of Fertility. 
Very nice. I'm not going to use it right now, but very nice. Color upgrade. <gasps> really? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Just because I can. I want to. Color upgrade. We want a purple one just because we can't. No, red needs to be high. This one needs to go low. Okay, that's a little too magenta for me. Maybe a little less red. Oh, yeah. There's my there's my purple furnace. Just because I can. Not because I need to. All right. And we'll open you and throw you in there. What? There we go. Don't, don't mess around on me. All right, cool. And then you go in there. And then you go in there. And I have a purple furnace. I have a purple furnace. I, I don't know why I'm so excited about that, but I have a purple furnace. Go Vikings. Purple and gold all the way. Yes, if you didn't know, I'm a diehard Vikings fan. Yes. Anyways, we got a purple furnace. I'm so excited. <laughs> it's, it's just, I don't know why it's so cool to me. Um, yes, but anyways, back to these. Oh, I'm so close. Look, if we get that. Oh, we can do this one. We can do this one. I know we can. We've got everything we need. I've got that, got that, got that. And I actually went back to get the uh, gra gravity, whatever it is. Gravity. Yeah, that's what I'll go with. And we have to enchant it, which means we need to make an enchanting table. I, if I spelled it correctly, oh, I have one. I have one. I don't remember. Why did I have an enchanting table? Do you guys remember why I made an enchanting table? Or did I get it in a, um, what's it called? Did I get it in a loot chest? I don't remember, uh, but I have one. Okay, cool. So we need to enchant five of these guys. Okay, this isn't how you enchant it. Or maybe it's because I don't have levels. Do I need to grab some levels? Huh. Inquiring minds want to know. Okay, see, the thing calls for enchanted gravity. I don't know how to enchant gravity. And these don't have uses. Like, the use is just to make those blocks. And then it gets used in other stuff, but it doesn't have a recipe. And this one does nothing. It just facades. That's all it does. Just, just facades. So how do I get the enchanted gravity? Okay, so it's not anywhere near difficult. It's just, we just have to make an altar of some sort. This altar right here. And that's really simple. I got plenty. Oh, yeah, we got this. Okay, so I don't need this crafting table or enchantment table, but I gotta make the altar, which is pretty simple. I've got everything in here. Yep, so you, you, see, I gotta make like 37 of them. All right, and then we'll plop you down real quick. All right, and I need to grab some of that yellow stuff. What was that yellow stuff called again? Um, at Aether, this stuff. So I'm gonna need five of these. Well, I'll just grab like half a stack. There we go. Um, okay, that's interesting how that works, but cool. All right, cool. We've got gravity. We've, 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 we've done it. Detect. Um. <clears throat> oh, you know, I gotta go grab a couple more ender pearls to make some eyes of ender. Oh my gosh, I, we, I don't think, one, two, three, I don't think I'll be able to get the other, where, do, there it is, the other furnace, but everything but the one furnace in alpha, ha, oh, I'm feeling a little bit accomplished right now, I am, I'm, I'm feeling a little bit okay, <clears throat> so let me grab you real quick and grab you, so you're all in my inventory as I detect it. And um, blaze, that's what I'm looking for, all right? So there's you and you, one, two, three, and that should do it. Do I gotta manually claim it? Hmm. I have 15 of those. Oh, I need 64 of the ambrosia. 64 of the ambrosia. I don't have 64 Ambrosia? Did I? 
to... I was so close. Well, we got... We, we got a portal. We can go get it. Uh, this is actually how I got the graffiti -t 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 -t, uh, just a little bit, bit before I started recording. Was I went and started mining out under the portal. Which you'll see in just a second. Yeah, I was just mining away and trying to find that graffiti. -t 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 -t. Okay, you leave me alone. And you leave me alone. What are you? Hey, hey, get away. Get away. Hey, hey. I don't know what's hitting me. I don't see anything. There it is. Get away. Okay, so anyways, um, I went down oh, somewhere around there, around here. Yeah, I, I dug a little hole. Oh, no, you know what? I remember I went off the edge. I went off the edge like this. And... Just started digging in and you can see, aha, there we go. That's some of what I'm looking for right there. Yeah, and I just started hollowing out this mountain. Like, I wasn't even messing around. I just straight hollowed it out. <clears throat> yep, there we go. Just using vein miner. My thing's on, so. Oh, darn it. Did I, did I bring it or did I leave it? Oh, I left it. I don't want all the holy stone. <laughs> Okay. Um, so the scary thing about being able to sneak is the fact that I can sneak off edges. And then if I let go and don't pay attention to that. Oh, hey, there's more gravity. I don't know of another use for it, so I'm just going to kind of leave it be. But there's more gravity and more gravity. Oh, that's the other part that I had already opened up. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of freaking blitzes over there. Why are there so many blitzes? So much of the gravity. I love just saying that over and over again. I don't know if you guys noticed, but yeah. I kind of have fun just saying it over and over again. Alright, so I'm going to hunt for this ambrosia. Ugh! Come on. There we go. I'm going to hunt for this ambrosia. And then uh, once I get a full stack... We will go back and uh, finish that quest. Oh my gosh, we're so close. <clears throat> Auto fire. Hey, hey, hey. Don't be knocking me off. All right, so yeah, I'm going to do that and then we will be right back. Okay, that only took like a second and then I was, I was back and actually everything's complete, right? Ambrosia, detect. Ha ha ha! We're almost done with Alpha! Claim that heart! Oh yeah, of course, I don't have anywhere to put it because I got all this junk in my inventory. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and nom nom this heart right here. Up to 11 lives. Alright, cool. So, we, we're, we're, we're like almost there. Let's make the knapsack while we're at it. Let's let us get this done. Um, I know I'm going to make some aluminum brass and I actually forget. Can I please hit the right button? Thank you. Um, oh, let's dump some of the stuff. I don't need the niter. I don't need you. I don't need you. Um, I got enough of you now. Uh, Menincio, whatever. I got plenty of that. And until we really get using it, it's just kind of an extra thing sitting around. Anyways, yes. So, uh, aluminum brass is aluminum. Um, we'll do it this way. Aluminum brass. There we go. Aluminum brass comes from, you know what? I always go the wrong direction. It's right there. It is a mixture of aluminum and copper. Yep, we can do that. We can do that easy peasy like. Um, copper, let's just go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And what was the ratio on it? Hmm. Hmm. I didn't really look at the ratio. I think it's a three to one aluminum. So what? Where did you come from? Uh, apparently I picked up a torch that should be right here. Hmm. Very curious. Let's let us put some more torches down. All right, cool. 
So I think it's three to one. Let's check that again real quick before I start smelting this. Uh, aluminum brass is Is that three to one? Yeah, three to one. Okay, cool. So, one, two, th don't pick up the stack. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three. There we go. Stop picking that. Mm, this thing's getting so annoying. Okay, cool. So, let me pick my wrench up real quick so it doesn't fill this. And we're going to need our. I think it's our tough rod. I ooh, what? I forget what the recipe is. Wow, knapsack. Haven't made it in a while. Knapsack. There we go. Because usually I do it all out of gold. So, oh, it's not even a new. Oh, it's Constantan with a brass ingot. Well, I just butchered that all together, didn't I? Okay. Well, I have Constantan, and apparently I'm gonna have aluminum brass too. So, um, yeah, yeah. Yes, I will have aluminum brass. There's the aluminum, there's the brass. Okay, let's go grab our constant hand because I know I've got some of that. And apparently I can't right click. Okay, so constant hand. There we go. One, two, three, four. I'm going to grab four. I don't remember how many ingots it is to make those. Uh... <sighs> I wish it would just stay and not do that. Um... I think it's one ink. Oh, it's a tough rod. It is a tough rod. What is... Let's go. I can see how many I need by looking. Because that's how we roll. Uh, tough rod is three. So I'm going to need six of these. Okay. I can handle that. Um, what I need to do is disconnect you like that. So, uh, Constantine. There we go. One, two. All right. You're good there. I will have my freaking tough rod and then leather please tell me I have some leather I have 18 pieces of leather we're good one two three four five six awesome oh we're so close and then a rebus red gems are coming oh I'm so excited all right so aluminum brass there you go constant melt up and oh I thought I grabbed you but I didn't I need the tough rod pattern, please and thank you. Put you in there. And we're gonna get ready to get you flowing. You're gonna take a second to cook up. So while that's cooking up and we're getting ready to make our knapsack, oh, we're gonna be so close. If we get those red gems today, if we can get those red gems, all we will have left is the extreme furnace. That's all we'll have left and alpha will be complete. But apparently it says I'm only at 60%. How is this? How? How is this considered 60%? I'm feeling so accomplished right now, and I am feeling so defeated by that number right there. Oh, goodness. I'm, I'm, I'm really feeling defeated by seeing that. Um, yeah, let's, let's look at the extreme furnace. We already looked at that, but I want to take another look. Another look at it real quick. Okay, that we can get. Oh, Mercury ingots, that's right. Yeah, uh, not until we get into Galacticraft. That's right. Now I remember. We just looked at it last episode, but it wasn't... I wasn't remembering. It happens. So, also, I do want to tell you, this guy right here... Nope, not that guy. This guy right here, the uh, refinery. Yeah, the refinery. Actually, oh no, that's the wrong refinery. The Magneticraft refinery actually a kind of cool little refinery turning um on this one it turns sewage into nutrient distillate distillation which would have been nice a while ago but we haven't you know more than enough right now and i'm thinking we'll have enough until we need to switch over to applied energistics but then it also switches um that tectronic petrothium into oil now if we didn't have an oil cow that would be really useful. But unfortunately, well, fortunately, we do have an oil cow, so that's not an issue. All right. Uh, there's one. Yep, there we go. And the next one. Okay. And now I want to... Whatever you just... I know some of you tried to leak out. I know you did. 
Oh, knapsack coming up. Woo! The jump can be a little bit annoying at times, but I put up with it because it's awesome. <laughs> Is there any other way to say it? It's awesome. It, was it gold in the middle? I think it was gold. Uh, gold ingot. No, it wasn't. What, what, what goes in the middle? What? The fact that I can't put back in here gets me every time. Um, knapsack. There we go. It was... Oh, brass. Oh, that's easy. Hey, where'd you go? There you go. We got our knapsack. So just more storage on top of storage here. We have our knapsack. Sweet. Oh, yeah. I love getting achievements. We are getting so close. Yes, Arebus. Arebus is in our future. Yep. However, however, I made plans for Arebus. It wasn't going to be for today, but I made plans. And we're going to go ahead and do it now. Because, oh, so this all kind of leads me to what I was going to show you earlier, which is my armor. Right? So I've been playing around. And I still don't have great armor. Let's start there before I really show you the stats. But... I have an extra seven and a half hearts because I get two and a half hearts from my chest plate. And it, that's what gives me my sneaking on air. I get two and a half hearts plus speed on my pants. I get two and a half hearts plus jump boot on my boots. And then I get my saturation and a speed boost from my helmet. Now, this one's prot eight, but the rest of these are like prot three and protection five, right? And they're unenchanted. So I'm going to continue to look for better ones. But for the time being, I, you know. We got what we got, and that's you know all there is to it. Let's something good, really. An iron paxel, I'm a little bit past that, just saying. But, anyways, what we were talking about was heart canisters. I had them all prepped and ready. Uh, now let's sink you. I had them all prepped and ready to go. All we had to do is make them. Boop. Heart canisters. Yeah, why I didn't make them, I don't know. I wanted to share that with you. I wanted to share the extra six hearts we're about to get. And look at them. We should be in a green now, huh? That goes in a green, huh? Let me see it. Yeah, green hearts. All right. Cool, 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 cool. All right. So we're done with that. To a rebus to get the red. Oh. Oh. Here it is. So we need 10 stone bricks, easy. Oak leaves, easy. Staff of Gaia and the Gaia Keystone. I think that's it, right? Yes, so I need two of those. Oh, one for the other side, probably. I don't know, we'll see. Um, Gaia, 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 Gaia. So how do we make these? This is actually, is it AEA? Yeah, there it is, okay. What is your recipe? We've got those, we just made them. I have glowstone ingots. I don't have a center block, but I can make it. There we go. All right. And what is this? Aerogel? What is this? What is this? There's, 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 there's no, how do I get it? What the heck is Aerogel? <laughs> what is it? Is that one of the clouds? I haven't seen this stuff. Oh, oh, and I don't have these either. Are those the ones from the nether? Okay, an offering. Oh. Okay, so here's the deal. I'm going to go take another trip to the Aether and see if I can find this aerogel stuff. And also, I'm going to make whatever, you know, an offering altar is. Uh, that what is that the same one? No, that's a different one. A-L-T-A-R. Is that the offering altar? No, that's the altar of light. Altar base, altar lightning, altar healing. Okay, offering altar. That's not bad. Yeah, that's not bad at all. Four pieces of stone, four stone bricks, a piece of obsidian and gold. Yeah, we can rock that. Well, let's do some of these right now while we're, you know, together. And then I can go do the rest later. Um... Crack stone. Oh, no. Oh, I don't want the crack stone. I just want stone bricks. There we go. That was the problem. Okay, so there's that. Okay. I should have the rest of this. I have obsidian. I have... Oh, stone. I don't have the stone. 
Got to cook. Oh, hold on. I just put some in here, didn't I? I did. I was like, I used up the rest of my stone, and there we go. All right, cool. So let's try that again. Offering altar. There you are. Now I should have everything for you. Cool. So we have our offering altar. We'll just plop you down there for right now. Right? And this was used to make the Gaia stuff. Right? So I'm going to need two of these. One for each one of these. Right? So I'm going to need two obsidian, two emeralds, and two diamonds. That is easy peasy stuff right there. So diamond, two. I'm getting quite a few emeralds nowadays. Yeah, 831. Um, I remember when I was just trying to get a couple to make some magical wood. A little bit past that now. Not to the point where, you know, I've got, you know, 20,000 of anything yet. But I've got a decent amount of some stuff. So cool for that. You, you, and you. Um, do I need like an open hand or something? Oh, it just says those three. It, I hate trying to figure stuff out. Offering altar. Those three go to this. Emerald, obsidian, diamond. Oh, okay. Hoo -hoo. It did it. Hey, how do I? Cool. Okay. So it just took a second. No, no need to pout. Sliders pouting. No need to pout. Let me. I always forget to leave my wrench over here, and I hate looking for it, so I'm going to drop that off over there. Oh, you know what? I actually got asked a question um, by my nephew, of all people, when he saw me do that in one of the videos. If you guys didn't know, um, as a default for Draconic, I believe it is, you have the ability to place items in the, in the world. So, I don't know if you guys are interested, but he asked, so I thought maybe there's other people who didn't know. But yeah, place item in world is P. Bloop. <coughs> <coughs> and there it is. Yep. Actually, I don't know if the default was P. I think I changed it to P for place, just to remember that. Um, let's see. So this way you can you you can know too for future reference. Um, reset. Nope. Re reset. Button one. No. Okay, so it is P. Yeah, yeah, it was P by default. I thought so. But I just remember P because it's for place. All right, so got you. All right, cool. And what was the rest of the recipe? So I need to go get some of these thorn vines. I believe those are in the nether. Um, Skyroot sticks from Skyroot planks. So I, yeah, I'm going to have to go back to the Aether anyways because I got to go to the Aether to find this arrow gel. But I should have the glowstone ingots... Let me double check. Okay, I got the glowstone ingot, so we're good there. Yeah, so I'm going to head back to Aether and get the arrow gel. And then I'm going to have to go to the nether and get the thorn vines. So, yes. Oh, my goodness. Look at all the cows. Look at all the cows. I hope there's some good ones over there. We'll check later. But anyways, yes, I'm going to go take care of all that stuff right now in the, 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 the two other dimensions. And then we will be right back. I just randomly got, um, oh, crystals. That was nice. I just randomly got an icosahedron and I didn't want to just throw it away. So I placed it. <laughs> hey, I got 10 crystals out of it. That was pretty cool. But I got here and I was like, oh, well, where can I find the aerogel? It turns out aerogel is, comes from placing lava here. So we're going to go back and get some lava and come back and we're going to get our aerogel. Awesome. 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 Here we go. So we might stick it out because I'm going to need this wood right here too. So let's get some of this wood. Nope, this is golden oak. Well, I'll get it too because it's just pretty. Um, you are now an expert. Oh, that was my hatchet. Um, I don't know what that sound was, but it was kind of cool. What are you? There's so much stuff that... Orange tree. That I didn't take the time to really check out. That I kind of want to check out while we're here. Like I kind of just ran around. Skyroot's the one I want. Hey, hey, wait, wait. Oh, you stupid guys. You're so annoying because you're so weak. And you keep moving. That's probably the most annoying thing. All right, cool. What am I... All right, so we got green sky root. We've got golden oak. We got the sky root log. So we got the wood that we need. Um, while I'm here, let me... What is going on? 
probably something with you. All right, let's, I'm free and clear over here. Let's just make sure there's nothing else that we need to get from here. Because gate, this isn't even, this is to go to Erebus. Okay, or yeah, Erebus, that's what we're calling it, right? All right, so I need five of those. So probably five blocks of lava, I'm assuming. And then I've got everything else. The thorn vines are from Nator. I'm almost certain those are the ones in the nether. Cool. So we got to go get five blocks of lava. We're just going to do it together. Oh, oh, what was that? Oh, are those those coins? Ah, ha, ha. All right. I really need to be careful. And I realize that with the coins, um, when my server, when I have issues with the server, I lose a lot of the player data. Like I lose my map data and stuff. And uh, then I lose those little coins. I just realized that. Because I had 67. I was like, I remember seeing those coins when I was in the Slider's Labyrinth. And I should have had more because well, I got 64 from those things when I put them in here. So I don't know. Anyways, um, we're going to need some buckets. So let's get some buckets real quick. And we're going to need to make you for once ever, please. No, I was going to hope. Okay, so we're going to need five buckets. I'm going to need 15 ingots of iron. So one, two. So 15. And then I'm going to need my hammer. Right there, it's getting pretty wore out. Okay, but cool, I got enough. And I might as well just... There we go. I was gonna say, make, you know, the sixth bucket, but no need. All right, cool. Let's throw you back in there. Um, I'm gonna keep you on me. Those are really pretty trees that I'm going to plant once we start planting some dirt. Oh, by the way, I just, I, I did, I keep forgetting these things. I made my uh, dirt stick. I got my dirt stick. That's actually how I put all the rest of the dirt down, which we haven't even been over there. But yeah, I got my dirt stick and I also um, increased my mana production here. So we've got the great band of mana as well as the great band of aura. I think the aura just helps keep things charged. The great band of mana actually collects it. And can be uh, transferred between, like, you know, mana pools and stuff. Just thought I'd throw that out there. All right, so five blocks of lava. There we go. And, whoops, come on. There we go. And, you know, I probably could have done that better. Gone to the nether, gone the 30 vines, got some lava, and then went back to the aether. <sighs> okay. But this works just the same. We, we've got our buckets on us, so I really hate how many freaking of those stupid, stupid, stupid blitzes are around. Oh, okay. Cool. Yeah. So that's, that's, that's it. Hey, see, li literally you guys are everywhere. There's just too many of you. Okay. Too many. I appreciate having a good adversary, but y'all suck. Because you're not even good adversaries. I got bink, 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 and bink. But that's cool. So that really wasn't nearly as hard as I thought it was going to be trying to find it. Quick, fast, and easy. We got it. And now to the nether. It'd be kind of cool to create a nether portal here. Just a linking system of portals. But eventually we'll get the draconic evolution um, portal thingamajig. I forget what it's called. Actually, I wonder if, can we make the other one? I mean, you know, I do get so stride tracked. I know, but it's not like I'm going to make it. I'm just curious if I can. This is the one I'm talking about, the Enchanted Tarma Dislocation, but we're nowhere near that because Wavering Cores and Nether Stars and Draconic Cores and Glowing Mountain Gamer. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. But can we make this guy? Yes, we can make this guy now. And uh, there's a pedestal or something like that. I forget. This thing. Yeah, there it is. Uh, Dislocator Pedestal. And we can make that and put it on there. Cool. Yeah, if you guys haven't seen it, I've actually done a, uh, I don't want to call it a tutorial, but mod review tutorial, whatever, on Draconic Evolution. I love that mod. Absolutely love it. And when I was playing it, I couldn't find a lot of information, so. Um, well, that was not smart of me. This is not where I wanted to go, and now I picked up a whole bunch of that junk. Oh. Silly, silly me. Yep, now I got a whole bunch of junk on me. I'm going to have to go dump my inventory again. Because those seeds... <coughs> <coughs> sorry. Uh, not seeds, but um, those plants. 
they're putting out stuff like no other and then there's always a whole bunch of just junk sitting around um i don't need you don't need you don't need you uh i've got five of you okay i'm whoa what was that quest updated how that was a what wait we already did that again okay i'm not i'm i'm not gonna do it i'm not oh a nugget cast oh that's interesting so it's just kind of a rotating one. Oh, that's kind of cool. Like, it just keeps coming up with other stuff. That's actually really cool. I, I like that. Um, let's open you up and see if we get anything cool. The last Icosahedra was cool. Now that's all garbage. All right. Let's throw that away. Um, base capacitor in there. Buckets in there. Wood in there. We'll grab it again. You in there. You're both trash. All right. Off to... I've got my portal. I don't have to run over there. There we go. Off to the nether the proper way or our new way. Oh, so let me tell you about these cakes here. I got a um, uh, an artifact weapon and basically says if you use it, it places clay cake. And I just thought it'd be fun. So I started placing cake. There's no purpose for it other than I like to be silly. All right. And then I did, I got bombed by a creeper right along the wall one time. So now I've broken the bridge so they aren't close. But I can easily jump across and sneak across and all that stuff. Yes. So uh, I hope, I hope I don't need shears for the thorns. I just thought about that. Okay, there's thorns right over there. Let's get you out of here, Mr. Pigman. Oh, yeah, I got gotcha. you. All right, let's go. Got you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mama. Mama dropped a whole bunch of you. Mama dropped a whole bunch of you, didn't she? Okay, there was way more than I was expecting. All right, I think I probably need shears. Oh. <sighs> I just keep doing silly stuff, not thinking about it. Like I'm, I'm so excited to get one thing done and then the next thing and then the next thing that I kind of forget the steps in the middle. Like, hmm, thorns are probably something you're going to need cheers for. Um, but I have a silk touch. Will that work? What do I need cheers? I think I do. Um, but will silk touch work? Ooh, hoo, hoo. here's the million dollar, the million dollar question. I'll be right back. Now I have shears. There we go. Much better. I knew it too. Like, that's just so silly of me. Oh, so silly of me. But I'm going to get a couple of these because if these are coming up now, I'm thinking there's a chance. Hey, 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 chill out. There's a chance they'll come up later. So might as well get a couple of them. It's only going to take an extra second or two. And I just remember, don't break the ones below or like above because then you don't get all the ones below. All right. So now we have everything and we'll hit Erebus and maybe we'll find our red gems and get a red furnace. I'm really just going to Erebus to get the red gems. Not really to check anything out quite yet. We might follow up in tomorrow's uh, episode actually checking out Erebus. Um, but right now, I just, I'm just i so concentrated on really finishing Alpha. We're so close. But I know I can't finish it because of Galacticraft. But I will feel okay moving on to other stuff since Galacticraft comes later. That moving on from something that I, you know, does that make sense? I hope that makes sense. Like, I'm okay with moving on because... Oh, check this out. Hold on. I was just... When I was coming over here. Anybody want to explain this to me? Fluid, frozen, water, fluid. I don't know about you, but I always called frozen water ice. So, that's liquid ice. That's, that's what I'm getting from that. It's liquid ice. I don't know. Whatever. I just saw that and thought it was funny. Uh, okay, so you go in there, you go in there. I don't need my shears now. All right, Erebus. So, Gaia. Gaia? Yeah, I think it's Gaia. No, I got you two already. 
Uh, I need to make you, which means I need to make you, which means boom. Pff. Come on. There we go. Come on. Oh my goodness. Where are you at? I put you in here. Where are you at? Uh, it wasn't called wood. What was it? <sighs> what was it called again? Skyroot. That's it. Skyroot. There you are. Oh, log. Skyroot log. Okay. One, two, three, four. Well, we'll do, we'll do six. I'm cool with that. There we go. Twelve of these. Cool. Get in the system. And we're so close. We're so close. Okay. So now we have enough to make both of you. So, bink. There we go. One, two. Oh, they don't stack. Well, that makes sense. All right. There's you. And then we got to make you, which we now have everything for you. Boop. And we've got you. And I got to make more of the stone blocks. Um, stone bricks. Stone bricks. I have stone in here. There's stone bricks. There we go. You. Alright, so we'll do that. And I am not shift clicking you out just in case. There we go. And then I need some leaves. I don't think it has to be oak leaves, but I'm grabbing oak leaves just to be safe. There it is. To the bug dimension. All right? I'm gonna set this guy up because this is gonna be totally temporary. This is literally just to go get the 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 the, the, the red gem. Okay, so it's gonna be like this. I remember this. I do, I do, I do. It's, yeah, it's like three wide. I'm gonna remember this. <laughs> I'm going to remember this. Um, it's like a, like it's almost like a weird diamond pattern like thing. If I remember correctly. Hey, man, you jump more than one block and it makes it difficult. Come on, don't do that to me. All right. Now I'm trying to remember the shape. I believe the shape is like this. I think, I think this is, really, can we dot, just put you guys in. I think it's like that, isn't it? Let me, let me double check. Well, now I remember why it was like this, because this was the shape I chose, because you can pretty much do any shape you want. And then I'll put you right here. And I fill you with leaves like this. Oh, I'm so excited. Man, this whole like glitching out thing. I don't know, whatever. There we go. And then take you and bingo. Ha ha. Here we go, Erebus. Oh, it's another dimension. This is four new dimensions in the last three episodes. I hope you guys enjoy new dimensions. I really do. And the one series, which I believe was, um, oh, what was it I was playing on? Um, Revenge of the Sea Team was the first time I ever went to Erebus, and I thought it was pretty cool. Um, you know what? I'm Before we do this, because I'm just going to dig like crazy, so hopefully this just keeps the portal open, right? I don't have to keep doing that. If I leave the staff there, it just stays open, I think. There, yeah, okay. The reason I came back was I want to get another Devnal. I have I made a couple of them, and I'm going to get so much junk that I don't want it. Uh, Devnal, there you go. I made a couple of them. Not a lot, but a couple. And I don't need the leaves anymore. I don't need torches. But I know I'm going to get a lot of that umber stone or whatever it's called. So I wanted to make sure that I had that in my inventory <clears throat> so it doesn't get over full. I don't see a big use for it anytime soon, other than I do really like it for paths. I like making paths out of this stuff with the chisel. So, uh, yeah, here we go. Boop. And put you in there. All right, let's find some red gem. What is that? See, I'm going to find all this cool ore, too. That's, oh, coal ore. Pass. Iron? Oh, lapis ore. I keep looking at, like, the tool required. Um, lapis tin. This is, everything's so pretty, though. Oh, vines, 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 vines. Remember, I needed vines. I needed vines and lily pads. I can finally get my vines and lily pads. I might just do that in the meantime as well, but I gotta find these red gems. Where are the red gems? Come on, find some red gems. What is that? Is that obsidian? 
Oh, oh no. Oh no. Nothing good can happen right now. Um, that's oil. And I'm drowning. I don't know which direction I'm looking. I can kind of see like I'm getting out of it. Why am I not vein mining? There we go. <laughs> I got out of you. Woo. Oh, okay. Yeah, that was oil. All right. Um, got to be careful around that stuff. Yeah, I could not. I couldn't jump. I couldn't get out of it. Ooh, that was kind of scary, actually. <laughs> I like. I don't know. I know. I really can't. Like, I don't want to say I can't die, but it, there's just a fear. If you know what I mean, there's just a fear. So, oh, you guys are here too. Die. You're here. Die. Yeah, I don't like you guys. I really need to find some red gems though. Ooh, is that emerald? That is jade. I've got so much jade, it's not even funny. Um, come on. There's got. Ooh, oh, it's like an open area. Okay. Um, maybe I need to go down. I know that these mobs are all really, really hostile here. Let's just, yeah, let's just go down. Yeah, let's. Let's not do that. Okay, let's go this way. Oh, there's more water. Oh my goodness. This is just water, right? Like, why is this affecting me so much? Oh my goodness. I'm not finding anything I'm looking for. Is that a spawner? Oh, there's spawners out there in the water. Or is that not a spawner? Oh no, it's like plants underwater. Oh my goodness. This is like an underground. I thought this was above the above land. Oh, it is. I was like, wow, that's so pretty. Um, is that a mob? Or is that a red gem? Could that be a red gem? Oh, that's got to be a red gem right there. Aha, yes, those are centipedes. Please tell me that's a red gem. Please tell me that's a... Biovelocity. Hmm. Something new. Petrified wood? No, that's that's not what we're looking for. Alright, let's go into the wall a little bit. We are going to find these red gems. It's going to happen. We're going to go all the way down. Maybe they're like, you know, diamond height. Who knows? Yeah, well, I'm at bedrock, so... I wish I knew where to find them. You know what? I think what I'm going to do, because I don't want to spend all my time just kind of digging around. I'm really not like looking for any of the bosses or anything like that right now. So I'm just going to hunt around until I find some red gems. And then once I do, we'll come back. We will go back. We'll make our furnace. And I think, I think we might just wrap it up there. If I can't think of anything else really cool to do in a reasonable amount of time. So we will be right back. All right, Traveler, so we're back and it didn't take that long at all, actually. I did a pretty good job of backtracking and, oh man, so much cool new stuff. Petrified wood, exoskeleton plate. I'm sure that's like armor stuff eventually. And more blitz rods. We can put that dev null back, except my inventory is full, so. All right, and I can't do that either. All right, furnace. Furnace, furnace, furnace. This one. All right, cool. So red gems, magma creams. That's easy. Netherrack, that's easy. Heat glass, I can chisel that. Oh, we've got this. We have did it. We 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 did it. I'm so excited right now. Uh, there are no words for how excited I am. All right, so I don't need you and I don't need you. I need to grab some glass to make some heat glass. And then also, um, clear, here we go. Um, do I have any magma? Yeah, I already have them, cool. Oh my goodness, I can't believe that everything just came together all so quickly at the very end. Um, 
like everything leading up, it just sometimes I feel as though it's just never gonna happen. And then it does. And that's exciting. That's really exciting. Okay. Furnace. It's it's probably like not even that cool. I, I'm I'm like I'm so excited about it. I'm like, eh, it's probably not that cool. Alright, cool. Got you. Put you there. Yeah. Oh, hold on. Let me put the storage upgrade in. Yeah. And then put you in. And are you gonna go back to purple? Hey, yes, you are. Let's test this bad boy out. Let us test this bad boy out. Did I ever did I remember to make the 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 other thing? The efficiency? Oh no, because I don't have a gas here. That's right. That's right. Gotta get a gas here. But anyways, let us test some stone out in this bad boy. Oh no, you went know no no. Um or let's let's just test out some aluminum ore. Just to test out this bad boy. How fast are you? Oh my gosh. Okay, that is worth it. I mean, right now I'm only doing one furs or whatever, but oh, let me let me grab some nether ore. Nether. Hey, get, psh, look at all this junk I have to get out of here. My 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 place is so crazy. Um, what is this? Nether coal ore. No, I don't want to do you. Uh, mithril ore. I want to do something fun. Eh, nether quartz. Let's check out the nether quartz. Oh yeah. Oh yeah yeah yeah. yeah. Look how fast that is. Oh, I am so happy. I am so happy. Because now I can also do this. We did it! We did it! Did it. Ah. I'm, I'm testing my luck. I am so excited. I'm testing my luck right now. Put you down. It's going to be like a horde of... Oh. Oh. Oh, the Seth Bling kit. Welcome back. Seth Bling here. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, man, I'm so excited right now. So excited. Oh, look at this. Things are just coming along. Oh, oh, and I still have my loot crate. Oh, an automatic hammer. Three of them. That actually, I, I plan on changing this setup down here um, to be a little more efficient. What are the 64s on? Oh, that's kind of cool. They like, kind of glow through. That's funny. Um, yeah, but I, I plan on changing the setup because the way I set up, it's not very easy to get the items out that I can't, you know, automatically take out. And so I'm going to reset this up again. I haven't found a happy way to do it yet. But for the time being, I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of... Why is there only 61 gravel? I did, oh, did I turn you off? I did, didn't I? Yeah, because I was getting too much stuff. Oh, no, you're on. Oh, you're on extract only. You just... You're not, you're not making gravel. Okay. Sure. Whatever. Um, anyways. Yeah. Sorry. I'm, I'm, I get, you know, lost in thought when I'm thinking about everything. I made such a complicated, like color coded system here and it was all working so great. However, I did not design a way to pull, um, yeah, these items when they, when they backlog in here and stuff like that. So I'm gonna have to redesign that again. But that's probably, this is all probably going to get moved to um, the last millennium because that's where I want to put the farm, which originally was where we were supposed to be going today. But, you know, things happen, things change. We could make that block and finish up there. Can we, should we do that? I think we can do that. Portal to the last millennium. Portal to the last millennium. Uh, burnt quartz. Um, there we go. One, two, three, four. And my furnace will cook you right up, won't you? Yes, you will. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, look at that. Cool. And what else did we need? We need whatever these blocks are. Um, okay. So I need to get some dyes. That should not be a problem. Looks like I'm going to need... Well, what's the recipe for... Okay, so it's... Okay, that gives me four. That's perfect. So I just need four stone, two dyes, and one ender pearl. Okay, we got that. I need a red, a blue, and a purple. All right, so Ender Pearl, got you. And I've got the <clears throat> some of the petals that are still over here from my uh, where my farm was. Oh, I don't know if you noticed, but yeah, I picked up the farm because that was going to go to the last millennium too. I really did have a plan, but um, huh? Well, I have red. I have purple. Oh, you know what? Let's do this. 
I have purple. I have magenta. We can just go make the pistol. The the bowl and pestle or whatever it's called. Um, bowl. And, nope. Uh, P-E-S-T. Uh, haha, there you are. How do I make you? Like that? I gotta make a bowl. I gotta make the bowl first. Make you. Thank you. And then I can make the bowl and pestle. Oh, jeez. Why, why do you take so long sometimes? All right, cool. <clears throat> and then I can just turn these into dies. Hopefully these work. I would assume they do. I would assume. All right, cool. Get you out of there and back to the portal. Like so. There you are. So make four of you. Perfect. Oh, 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 oh. and a clock, a clock. A clock. A clock. We've got it. We've got it. This is actually, I mean, a pretty efficient episode, I, I think. And I had a lot of fun, which is like the most important thing for me is having fun. And I hope you guys are having fun too, watching me kind of be crazy and all over the place. Because I literally do every episode. I promise you, I plan. This is what I'm going to do. And this is what I'm going to do. And this is what I'm going to do. And then I don't. <laughs> But it is in the plan. Um, I'll just put you right here. Lost Millennium. This is where we're going to finish up. Because actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the groundworks for my f uh, my mob spawner here. Well, hello, Mr. Last Villager with no trades. How you doing? Good. Hope you're okay. Stay there. Don't fall off. Burnt quartz. Oh, it's so cool. So, yeah, we're here. And uh, apparently it's like always nighttime here, I think. I forget. But yeah, mobs will spawn. So we don't want to stay here, you know, too long. We don't want our villager to get like, you know, ransacked by a zombie. So anyways, guys, I hope you guys are enjoying. Um, I'm having a lot of fun. And I am so, so, so excited about this right here. We are literally down to the very last. How? How is that possible? We're at 50%. We were at 60. Now we're at 50. How is that even possible? I don't know. But all we have is the extreme furnace left and we will be done with alpha. And we've also done a lot on beta and I will probably continue to work on that. This is going to be my next step doing the, um, the Terra steel to get these guys. Oh, but I hope you guys are enjoying. I'm having a blast. If you guys enjoy and want to see more, please hit that like button. And if you're brand new to the channel and uh, you want to see more craziness like this and kind of see me adventure through, I'm definitely not a pro Minecrafter who does this on a regular basis. Well, I do, but <clears throat> I haven't had a lot of experience with a lot of these. So a lot of these mods. So it's all kind of new to me. So it's not like, you know, I know what I'm doing ahead of time. I'm kind of going with the flow and learning. And if you want to see more experiences like that, hit that subscribe button. You'll get a notification when I post a new video. And until then, guys, y'all know the deal. I'm Slider Havoc, and I'm out of here. Peace.